As the school reopening dates draw closer, the question of how safe learners will be in school continues to give parents and the Ministry of Education sleepless nights. Even as Education Cabinet Secretary Professor George Magoha insists that the government is ready for school reopening come Monday. To ensure that they become innovative. For example, in this school, you can see in between the trees, if the weather is as good as it is now, nothing stops the head teacher who is an excellent teacher, from having classes outside there, in addition to others being inside the room. Speaking while inspecting schools in Moranga County, Magoha has urged the school's management to be considerate to students from poor background and not to shut their doors for any learner who failed to clear their school fees. For areas where fees are payable, you remember the whole primary school is free. As per our constitution, may I kindly ask the teachers, to go one step further and look for the indigent children and give them all the help that is required. Magoha has also dismissed politicians who he has accused of trying to politicize the reopening of schools, giving a stern warning to those who are trying to sabotage the national exams. The schools, as you all know, will reopen on Monday the 4th. So you must stop listening to toxic politics. We are not politicians, we are workers, and our children do not belong to any political party. This comes even as Narok County Commissioner ordered all chiefs to ensure all students go back to school next week, with plans underway to ensure that pregnant students and those that became mothers are reintegrated back to schools. Tunataka kwa kikisha ya kwamba kila mwanafunsi, kila mtoto, ambaye akona umri wa kwenda shule ako shuleni hatutaki kusikia sababu yoyote mwanafunzi kutokuwa shuleni and in Gatundu village Kiambu county a group of 100 orphans have renewed their hopes of completing their education after a group of women offered to pay their school fees for the 2021 academic year we have been working very hard to make sure that our orphans Na watoto wale wamekosa, watoto wazazi wamekufa, wazazi wamekosa uh, any help, we are able to help them. The well-wishers among them, retired teachers from the area, stated that most of the beneficiaries are children whose parents have died or have been neglected, noting that many of them drop out of school and become mothers and wives at a very young age due to poverty. To idea wazazi, wale wameachiwa watoto wengi sana. Kuna wengine wameachiwa kama five children, wengine wameachiwa kama ine, wawili, watatu, moja, hivi. Nani waze? Tukafikilia uh, kwa tukaona mungu ametujaria na ametupatia. Kwa hivyo ni vizuri tuone kila mwaka, kila Christmas, si ati tukonazo na tukaona, tukaonerea ni vizuri tuwapatie. Jujina Magundu, K24 Evening Edition.